Well, whatever time of day or night it is with you, welcome along to a game which is threatened, I have to tell you, by a rather forbidding weather forecast. The expectation is for quite heavy rain as the game grows older this evening. It hasn't arrived just yet, but it will do shortly. That's a report, though, that that hasn't affected the crowd who are here in good number and indeed in good voice. And the game will be underway very soon. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. Things on the way. Mings played in with accuracy, and it's played forward. It's a long ball, and it's not hit its target. Mondi, forward it goes. was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance looked very promising uh, that was just poor decision making and a weak execution Justin drives it forward Mondi and here's Vardy can't get the better of his opposite number well, defence got the better of him this time but I'm sure he'll go again Keeper sends it forward, and it's Castan. Castan is making a foray down the right. Great leap! Goal, Leicester! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front, and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Leicester get themselves into the lead. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Now it's Perez. And here's... Oh, shooting chance! He scored! And they're at it again in double quick time. Leicester are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Leicester get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Tielemans plays it forward. Back into the middle. And he heaves it forward. Tielemans. Barnes. Shoots! Well, even for him, that may have been a touch ambitious. Well, here is the raid we were told to expect. Can he deliver? Barnes. Pratt spreads it towards the left. And it's Barnes. Tielemans and here's Perez steered in 
cleared without complication. And that'll be the final action of the first half. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Leicester are two up and everything is shaping nicely. The only criticism, it could have been three. And that's the start of another 45 minutes. No reported change to either side during the break. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Gilbert gets good distance on it. Tielemans, Perez, he does have an assist to his... Has a hit! <laughs> Tielemans, who's short. Lovely feet. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Louis gets rid without sophistication. Justin. And here's Barnes. Tielemans. He's gone for goal. Can it could fall kindly? Mings tries to get it forward quickly. And here's Perez. Pratt. Just brushed off the ball there. The big chance! Yes! And they are cruising away. What about that, Jim Beglin? Yeah, and I think we may have had too many defenders ball watching then because they just lost sight of the real danger. He's made it three, quite a day at the office for him. Oh, this has been an immense contribution for one player. He's been just about unplayable. The irresistible force today. Leicester are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Watkins looks to get on the end of this. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Well, it's about time, isn't it? Only after he's uh, just notched a third. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Now it's Perez. That and the finish! And in it goes! Players ecstatic, fans delirious. This is utopian. Jim, your thoughts? Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Four in the game. He is the man. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Well, to wait until now to make this change seems a bit baffling. He's expecting the miraculous to turn this around from here. It's become a case of men against boys. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Ndidi. Just five minutes left. Looking crossfield, changing the point of attack. Fuchs. And it's got through. Cut out in the nick of time. Al Ghazi floats one over. So that's it. It is all over.
Leicester enjoy their perfect day for their victims. It is entirely imperfect. Comprehensive winners of a one-sided contest. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Of course, we all love to watch the creative side of the game and goal scorers, but there's an art to good defence too, and their organisation and discipline has helped earn this win.